This is Eddie Silva for the SLSO blog, and um, right there is the St. Louis Symphony Orchestra, and it's a few minutes before rehearsal is going to start for Berlioz's Symphony Fantastique with uh, the Finnish conductor Susanna Malki conducting. She'll be on here in just a little bit. Hi, I'm Callie Bannum. I'm the English horn player with the St. Louis Symphony. I'm really excited about the program this weekend, this Friday night and Saturday night. I'm doing a terrific program with Suzanne Malky, and it's a great program for the English horn. Uh, I have two really big solos. Um, there's a, a beautiful passage in the Ravel Piano Concerto, and then there's another um, really incredibly lonely and desperate sounding English horn passage in the Berlioz Symphony Fantastique. My colleague Barbara Orland will be playing the oboe off stage, and it's our first time playing the piece together, the duet at the beginning of the third movement. I'm really excited to play it. I haven't done either one of these pieces with the St. Louis Symphony. And uh, it's going to be a great week. Thank you, Callie. Good morning, Felicia. This is Felicia Folan, who plays uh, bassoon for the St. Louis Symphony. Good morning. I'm here to talk about the Ravel Piano Concerto, which we're playing this week at the St. Louis Symphony Orchestra. It's a favorite piece of mine because Ravel is a favorite composer. Uh, many listeners will recognize the beauty of his music. And the piano concerto is a wonderful example of this. In particular, the second movement uses a Ravel extended melody and with intricate harmonies that are both modal and tangible and maybe a little jazzy. Ravel's language and music was not quite Spanish and not quite French. He really innovated a language rather between those two types of music, impressionistic, nationalistic. Whatever you say, um, right. The second movement is a um, standalone gem in the orchestral repertoire. It's a gorgeous English horn solo uh, that shadows the piano, played by Callie Bannum. And you'll hear these wonderful inventions that Ravel uses, including trills that start high and don't trill upward but downward, giving it a sense of animation. He's a very innovative composer, and if you just like music that sounds beautiful, come. And if you like to enjoy the intricacies of composition, the orchestral voice, come for that reason too. We'll see you this weekend, St. Louis Symphony Orchestra. Thank you. Thank you, Felicia.